In this tutorial, we will take a look at the Examples folder to see some example items of things that Ubuntu Linux can do. By double-clicking on this folder entitled Examples, a window will pop up, which is the Nautilus file manager, containing a variety of icons of documents, audio files, and video files about Ubuntu Linux. For example, there is a short movie here called Experience Ubuntu, which is in the Aug Theora format. That is an open source video codec. There's also some audio files, a presentation, several images, and other documents. There is one document here called About These Files. And this is an open document format document that can be opened with OpenOffice, which is a groupware suite that is included with Ubuntu Linux, similar to Microsoft Office. OpenOffice contains a word processor, a spreadsheet program, a presentation program, and many other tools. Right-clicking on this document, for example, shows open with OpenOffice.org word processor, and selecting that will launch the OpenOffice.org application and display this document. Now, because we are running a live CD, things are much slower than it would be if this distribution was installed on the hard drive. In other words, once Ubuntu Linux is actually installed on a hard drive, it will run much faster. Live CDs tend to be much slower, much more resource intensive because it is running solely off of the CD-ROM and in memory. While the OpenOffice.org document is loading, I will click on the file browser in the background. This is the Nautilus file manager that comes in with Ubuntu Linux. It's part of the GNOME desktop. It's a very full-featured file manager that can, has, is very capable and can do a lot of things, uh, some of which will, will be explained in future tutorials. You will notice here on the on the left hand side of the file manager several icons or shortcuts to different locations on the system. The OpenOffice.org word processor is now loading and is loading that document that we clicked on in the Nautilus file manager called About These Files. This document explains the files that are in the examples folder. This examples folder, the, the, the purpose of this folder is to uh, provide a way to show the various things that Ubuntu Linux can do with the default installation, including graphics, multimedia, and documents. This document right here provides an overview of everything that is contained in the examples folder. You can right click on the icons in the taskbar to close them much as you can in other operating systems. Or one can click the close button in the upper right hand corner. The other icon on the desktop is the icon that walks you through the installation of Ubuntu Linux onto your hard drive. That is the end of this tutorial. Thank you very much.